So you probably tried to lucid dream with an alarm, right? You've all seen these tutorial videos where it says you lucid dream in five minutes and what you do is you set your alarm for 4 a.m., you wake up, you go back to bed. Okay, you have probably tried that, that's quite annoying. It works, if you do it right, it works quite reliably, but you probably want to learn how to lucid dream without an alarm. So without having to wake up early and annoy yourself and your partner, annoy your dog uh, by waking up early. In this video, I will tell you exactly that. By the way, just for this one, I know our attention spans are going lower and lower every single week, but just for this video, please turn off the other tabs, turn off distractions, turn this video up, turn the volume up, maybe make it full screen and just kind of really get cozy and let's dive into this, okay? I promise it will help you. Okay, so alarms work, interruption techniques like wake back to bed, they do work, but they make you tired and they, let's be honest, you don't wanna do them, okay? They're gonna ruin your sleep and make you feel tired. It's not realistic and it's not consistent because you can't do that every night, otherwise you just wouldn't have any sleep. Okay, so you want to lose a dream, but you need to do it in the right way. Before I tell you, you need to subscribe and like this video. No, I'm just kidding, uh, but please do that. You need to do it by relying on background techniques. What I mean by background techniques is a technique that doesn't require you to interrupt your sleep. Something like the mild, the dialed, or the D-E-I-L-D. -E Those techniques have also been proven to be the most effective, but they will be the most reliable and the most consistent techniques. By the way, I mentioned this, there's actually a whole section on this in the uh, Lucid Dreaming Bootcamp, which is a proven printable template which guarantees that you'll lucid dream in less than two weeks. There's dozens and dozens of reviews, probably hundreds at this point. You can go to howtolucid.com or howtolucid.com slash bootcamp, or the link is in the description. And people are crushing it with this. Like this is one of the golden keys to lucid dreaming. And it really comes back down with the background techniques. It really focuses on the basic things, mindset, affirmations, intentions, belief. And then within that, you can throw in other mental techniques like meditation, self-awareness, reflection, and mantras. So by focusing on background techniques, things like the mild, you don't need to set an alarm because the technique is literally your self-awareness and prospective memory. The ability to remember to do something in the future, in this case, to become lucid or to do a reality check sometime in the future where you don't know when it will be, but it will happen sometime. It will be maybe triggered by a dream sign. And this is part of the dialed technique, right? It will be triggered triggered by something that happens in the dream, recurring dream, recurring nightmare, whatever. Or it can just be triggered by a time delay. And this is where prospective memory comes in. You, if you train yourself to do a reality check in a certain block of time, you, you've cracked the code, okay? So if you, if you can train yourself to do a reality check, to remember to do a test in three hours time or in five hours time, and you're able to do that consistently in the day, then it's guaranteed almost that you, if you, Set the intention to do it when you go to sleep. In five hours time, during your REM sleep, you will remember to do it again and become lucid. And again, I break this down in the Lucid Breakthrough course, which you can find it on howtolucid.com. And it really does, you know, people are really getting crazy results with this. Like people who have struggled for years, they learn this system and they're, get, they're getting guaranteed lucid dreams most nights with very little effort, if any. So if you wanna learn kind of where to dive in, where to jump down the rabbit hole, you really wanna be focusing on things like improving your memory, improving your focus, your prospective memory, and doing brain training, and as well as meditation, because these things are really gonna help you with actually learning the, the things that will get you to become lucid more often. Leave a comment letting me know what you want me to make a video about next, because I know there's been a lot of different topics on this channel, so I'd love to hear, you know, do you want me to go into the shifting stuff? Do you want me to make more music tracks? Do you want me, what do you want me to do? You know, I'm happy to do a bit of everything, but I would really like to know where you need the most help because then I can just make that video. So leave a comment down below and check out howtolucid.com slash bootcamp or just go to the homepage and just have a little look around. If you haven't been there for a while, lots has changed. It's basically a huge resource with everything you can imagine about lucid dreaming and biohacking and sleeping all in one place. So if you haven't been there for a few years or months, I guarantee you that there's a lot of stuff there. So go and check it out.